Hello everyone, I'm Zack, and the creator of this channel, and I'll be continuing Digimon World, Next Order. Right now I'm gonna talk to Monzimon and get Toy Ankamon's block back. But first... Gotta rid of- Gotta get rid of this. Who are you? You came here to play with me? Get back Toy Agamon's block. Nope. Nothing doing it. This is a present from my friend. This is my treasure. So no. Not thing doing. You're talking about how Toy Agamon can't move. Huh? What do you mean? This block came popping out when me and Toy Agumon were playing, so I took it. It's true, he hasn't come play for a while, but I had no idea that happened. Sorry. Yeah, sorry. Just cause my face don't change don't mean I ain't sorry. Hey you, let's be friends. I'm going to the city. See you later. Yeah, I have no idea how do you supp- I have no idea how do you even talk the same way as him. I don't know how to read uh, whatever Monzimon was saying. Hey Toy Agamon, I get your stuff back. You but brought my block? Th y uh, th thank you. Now I just uh, stick the block here and here and there we go. go. Now I can finally move. Now we go to your s city as things, okay? It's uh, settled. Oh, I guess he, he does talk the way he does. Still, that Monzimon, how the thoughtless of him. Gotta b be careful next time we b play. So, I'm guessing that's just the way he talks. <laughs> it isn't that the block is preventing him to speak. That's, he, that's how he does. <laughs> Great, now he's got me saying it too. Like I said, what I'm trying to say was the block Excellent. doesn't help him talk. He always talked like that. It's just the fact he can't move his body. How come the moon is way bigger in fictional stories compared to real life? Didn't scientists say... I'm pretty sure scientists say that uh, the moon keeps on spiraling away from the Earth. So, what would happen if it keeps on going? Unless it still is. What happens when it turns nighttime? Would the moon still be there, or would it just be flat out disappear? Over here. Because I do not know. God has made made my day. <sighs> Alright, off to absolute zero. Just hang out in a bit longer. You need to talk to Ikakumon and 
Come on, man. Come on, go faster. Come on. Whoa ho ho! You brought me Mega Seedramon's fishy picture! Oh yeah! This is the fishy picture from Mega Seedramon! I've always dreamed of it! Oh man! Oh jeez! This is just too cool! I can't believe I got my hands on it! The paper on this fishy picture is a bit beat up. Was there some kind of battle or something? I have to thank you, somehow. Do you have anything you'd like to collect? Huh? You're gathering Digimon in the city? Haha! <laughs> I see, I see. Guess I'll go join your collection. Huh? Come back to town. Okay, hopefully I'll reach it. Hang on, just one more. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, talk. Huh? Really? So Rafimon is gonna start cooking again? This is fantastic! If I could go to the restaurant in the city, I can eat delicious cuisines again. I gotta do it. I'll head to the city. This is all thanks to you. Okay now. Okay, return to Flotia. All right, this is everyone. Well. Let's dive right in and hear how everyone's work has turned out. Thanks to all of your hard work, Flotia is now capable of launching Project Reincarnation. The town is now effectively a massive computer processor. If we insert Omega Mon's Wart D here as the core, his purification power, combined with the antivirus, should bring about a total data purge. Huh. You're gonna turn the town into a purification device? Indeed. We will load the entire digital world into the town, and after the purge, revive it as reborn data. This is, in essence, reincarnation. Where are you gonna store all that data? You can't just store a copy of all of the digital world inside the digital world itself, can you? You're right. We'll need to resolve all network gaps and migrate the data somewhere else for a time. And this is one colossal heap of data. So we'll need to move it, purge it, and swap it back chunk by chunk. Ah. But then, won't the reborn data get infected by the BH program as soon as we restore it? There are grounds for concern, but we have no other option. Wait, there may be one other way. What do you mean? We've nearly pinpointed the address that Lucia's toy was transmitting to. Shoma Suzuki's location. Huh? Where is it? Somewhere in the digital world? No, it's in a place called the Singular Zone. What? The Singular Zone? Impossible! Uh, what's the Singular Zone? The Singular Zone is where the digital world's deleted data ends up. Not unlike what the human world calls the beyond. The idea that it exists at all, let alone that a human could set foot there, is pure fantasy. I was skeptical too. The facts are facts. We found a vast, essentially infinite blank space in the area that was picking up Lucia's signal. In there, we observed multitudes of formless blocks of data plus the data of a number of Digimon, and one human. Hmm. An infinite blank space, you say? 
If that's true, the AR plan may be closer to realization than we thought. But... An infinite space? Sounds like the perfect place to move the data to. Exactly. No need to move it piece by piece. We could migrate all the data there together at once. What about a way to access the singular zone? Have you found one? Once Talmon finds his head, he can open the way. Wait, what? Huh. My head is where it always is. I am perfectly calm. Clearly. So there should be no problem. We did it, Loosh! This is a big feat! Really? I have big feet? <sighs> Why? What are these options? Fine. <laughs> Anyway, things sure are looking brighter for us. Just have to set the plan in motion now. Coda and I can go to the server tower and retrieve the Digital World's backup data. They say that everything since the inception of the Digital World is recorded and stored there. There might be some important data there that we need to have reincarnated. Way to casually drop a critical mission on us. Talmon and Lucian and I will go beneath the town and open the gate to the Singular Zone. What should I do? You're in charge of defending the town, Himari. Who knows when the enemy might stop by? Okay, you got it. You. We want you on the front line. You'll enter the Singular Zone. Thwart Suzuki's plans. Get Omega Mon's War D back. And save all our worlds. Got it. Got a second? Made, made my day. Though it might be difficult because one of my partners is about to die. Time to say goodnight. And three, two, one. And Rosemont's dead. So, hold your partner in your heart so, let's and see. hope for the best. Which Digimon? Okay, <laughs> I better stop or else I'll be sued by giving people that weird mental condition where if they seem flashing colors, they have that weird reaction. Um, let's see. Which Digimon would be a good pairing? Geomon, Geomon's line mixed along with Renamon's? Hmm. Yeah, sure, why not? Yarimon! I don't know what his first stage noise voice sounds like. Ready? Digimail. This is the final battle. Now our Wow. To be honest, I thought this game would be a lot longer, but I guess it's only long if you make it long. As in, like... Don't... Because I always, like, constantly... be beat up here and there multiple times... in my first attempt, which why it took me so long. Well, maybe I didn't took me so long, it just seems like I took so long was because I already beat the game and I was just like spending the rest of my time, spending r the rest of my time trying to fill up the gauge thing. 
the field guide. Stay focused. I can't go any higher with that type of voice. <laughs> How can a voice like that go any higher? Luck. Lock, lock, lock. I can easily do that. Take this STR. seriously. Dang it, I missed. Training time. Training time. Kitchy man, kitchy ball two. Gamma. It took me so long in my first attempt to try to get him. Training time. Nice going. Graumon, Graumon Orange, Trianamon, nope. Luck, luck, luck. I'm gonna go to the store to buy some of those um gem things so I can use Ask and Talamon. Oh, hello! Isn't it great here? Buying and selling stuff in a, a shop. This really suits me. You should buy up. I've got a great stuff here. Alright. I am in Tylamon, Master of Knowledge. I shall impart upon your my wisdom loss of yours. Uh let's see. Rent Vichimon, nope. Try that again. Actually, I'm not really sure. I'm kind of mixed of which Digimon should I pair with Geomon. Either Terriamon or maybe Trianamon line. I don't know. It's hard to make any decision on that. I think I'll go with... Um... Man, this is hard. 
Yeah, why not? I'll pair him with Trianamon. I think that might work. Yeah, I got Red Vegemon again. Take this seriously. Ready? Ready to eat? Ready to eat? Eat up! You're getting stronger. Raise up me. He... You're getting stronger. Well, we need to go to the bathroom. Praise. Good, that's it. I keep getting Growlmon's... Growlmon orange... So, ...stats instead of regular Growlmon. Stay focused. Almost had it. Alright. Ready? Over here! Food... Give you it's this one. It's chow time! It's chow time! You hungry? Okay! Here we go! Training time! I'm kind of multitasking a little bit because I'm checking my timer. I have like a minute and 50 seconds. Hey! No. Come yeah, on. That's wrong and you know it. Time to say good night. Go to sleep. Okay now. Here you go. It's chow time. Here you go. Training time. I'm going to end the video here, because a rookie doesn't digivolve until day three. So if you like what you see, leave a like, comment, subscribe, and share with your friends if you like. See you in the next video, and when I'm at day two, I'll record the training session and also do my voice impressions to do some little bit of entertaining. But it won't take too long for the training session to begin. Anyways, see you in the next video.